this can be brought to people who are overcoming and being renewed in, in recovery. Because people will say, like, well, I, I go to A, but, like, I, I can't get down with the God thing, or I can't, you know, I'm not a religious, but it's not a religious program, it's a spiritual program. It's a God of your achievement. So I think that the heart, that's what is true, and then the head can help us strategize about, you know, how actually we're to lead the ashram and how we're going to do that. Right. It goes on and creates beautiful content. Yeah, but the head shouldn't be making those huge decisions. The heart should be making those, and then the head has to figure out how to work out to my mind the work that you've done and all the science that you've um, that you've done over the years really <laughs> proves this out for me like it validates this methodology to be like the people and this is a big piece I think there's a lot of people who have spiritual trauma or religious trauma, like because of some experience when they were younger where, you know, it doesn't necessarily have to be physical abuse, but some level of, you know, bad experience occurred in their relationship to I think those relationships. It's all in there. The altruism, the service, the uh, the meditation piece, the you know, availing yourself for others, the surrender, the 